Hey, it's Cody here. I just finished playing tennis and in this video, I will share my personal journey on how I reached financial freedom with you guys. There's no elevated status intro. There's no sales pitch at the end. Just enjoy the video. Enjoy the video. So to start, I'm just like most of you guys. I want to be rich, I want to be happy, and I want to save the world. And before I go into my personal story, here are the three facts I'm going to share with you guys. First, not a lot of people are good with money. Poor people, middle class people, your financial advisor, stock market guru, or even a presidential candidate. Second, is getting rich enough to retire is not as far as you thought. It might only take you six years. And the third fact is that working is much better if you don't need the money so when i was in first year of university i was sharing a room with a roommate yes it's a room not the whole apartment and halfway through my career i got myself a honda civic si as a manual car and i had a lot of fun driving it i thought i made it in my own way and at the age of 29 six years into the corporate world i was able to retire from my job and travel to toledo spain and fast forward to today i'm turning to the age of 33 i'm still retired Tire and I don't have superpower and you guys will be surprised that a lot of you guys who are living in Canada or a rich country can also live the similar kind of life it's wonderful to become rich enough to retire but what if you can't imagine yourself sitting around all day doing nothing and I agree most of you guys who are watching this video is gonna click the like subscribe and reach your own financial freedom at a surprising young age it doesn't mean that you will stop working but just means that you might pick a different line of work that you're passionate about because work is a lot more fun when you don't need the money so who am i why am i qualified to talk about this so my name is cody a on the internet i'm known as cody a investing in real life my name is still cody a i was invited as a guest speaker for td bank to talk about how to earn potential income in different market conditions through stock option investing and to this day i'm an accidental lifestyle guru who likes to play tennis and nine years ago when i started working full time I had a dream I want to become rich I want to help more people and I want to save the world and three years in I met my girlfriend Claudette and we went on dating had a lot of fun and become more serious and eventually we want to have kids we both want to be super dads and super mom work full-time job and also pick up our kids from work and spend a lot of time with them but I currently live in Canada and no one told me that it's impossible before I came here in 2010 so we get down to work we started getting more serious about the wealth building we had a six-year game plan I graduated as an engineer and I got a job as a project manager I worked really hard with hundreds of hours of overtime every year and I saved up $73,000 thinking that I can buy my first house but guess what I'm still short so my mom lent me $37,000 thank you mom if you're watching this video and in case you're wondering in our culture parents helping kids buying their first house is actually quite common and while I've depleted all my down payment to buy the first house I was in the process of learning a lot of stocks and stock option investing and I was able to retire at the age of 29 because my trading profit replaced my full-time income so I had options now and not too long after my retirement I took a trip to Toledo Spain where I was making a few trades after lunch before my siesta and those few trades profit was enough to cover for my entire trip Claudette and I also went to visit Banff to see the glacier because we don't know how long it will last. We climbed the Rocky Mountain and that just say even until this day I cannot believe with my own eyes what I saw. And the reason why I'm sharing this with you is because a lot of my friends instead of choosing the six-year retirement plan they're still working at their job just over broke. And it goes something like this. They graduate with a huge student loan. They get their first job yay and they bought their first car brand new on credit of course and you guys might be like Cody you're driving a Porsche too are you a hypocrite hey just so you know I bought this car used with 40% of the MSRP price knowing that right now the interest rate is really high so the interest rate stabilized will go down lower I'll be able to sell this car at a break-even or a minimum losses so that's potentially how you can drive a nice car almost for free and go back to my friend's story they go out to have meals every day and eventually they met someone's special they spent fifty thousand dollars on the wedding then they buy their first home with five percent down or even one percent down with the new 
Zillow policy. Why? Because they can never save up a down payment of $100,000. Then they want to upgrade their houses and they go ahead and upgrade their cars once they get a promotion. And along the way, they get themselves a few toys like a motorcycle or a jet ski or a boat. And before they know it, they're over the age of 30 or some of them are even in their 40s and they still have no money. And this might sound familiar because this is what everyone does. This is the classic middle class American's life. And you know what? This is a strange feeling when you're working your butt off with a meaning. Oh, did I mention that I got bored after traveling around for a bit after retirement? I'd escape the cubicle so I can start doing the things I really like. I started this YouTube channel and until this day, I still laugh at my first ever video. Be led in sports world shutdown. NHL delay possible restart day. Cineplex closing theaters across Canada. Then I found that it's very fun and rewarding to educate people about reaching their financial freedom while they're all stuck at home. And because of doing that, let me to be become a guest speaker for the TD Bank. And having some followers means that we can hold our own meetup. So overall, I'm getting further and further ahead in life. With complete financial freedom, I'm no longer living the very frugal life. I'm still watching all my spending though. And with all the freedom, I find myself spending more time making videos, educating people on personal finance and investing. Oh, did I mention that I also interview people who already made it or on their way to the financial freedom on my Wolf Busters podcast. Make it work, proof of concept, full steam. If you're interested, the link is in the description. It turns out work is for its own sake. I'm much busier than ever than before with a bigger meaning to save the world. And thanks for staying until this part of the video. The true reason I'm making this video is just to show that it's possible to have a shorter time frame to reach your financial freedom. If you enjoyed this video and you want to watch my most viewed video on this channel, click here. And I'll see you on the next video. Say yay.